All right, this is John Black, super chemist. Uh, this is a nice, easy video because it's just telling you how to get something already pure. You don't even have to recrystallize it. Um, I looked up the MSDS on this. It's 100% uh, potassium nitrate. Get a good look here. As you can see, it's a spectroside stump remover. Uh, so you can go to Lowe's, go to the, where you, you know, stump remover. And uh, make sure that it's 100% uh, light. When you open this up, you can tell it's it's 100%. I mean, there's no other blue crystals or, you know what I mean? It's all nice and white. This is one thing you could uh, use a lot of uh, because it has a lot of uses. Um, I, need, I basically need it to make some... Uh, nitric acid which is going to be one of my next videos that's why i'm making this video well this is why i, I need to make some uh, nitric acid i'm starting to get away from this but you can see i got some silver nitrate there and i'm using these kind of jars see how it has the metal lid they're like i guess for I don't know, when you have vegetables or whatever and you store them for a long time, you put them in these, whatever you call that. Uh, but if you look inside, look at that lid. It's gotten all brown and rusty nasty. And look at my uh, silver nitrate. See that? It's all brown, all the rust fell inside there. It looks like garbage. I mean, there's no, I mean, where's all the white crystals? What? You can see there still is some, some in there, but a lot of brown. So in order for me to make the silver nitrate, again, I need to make nitric acid. And later on, I'll have to fix that there. I'll have to maybe get the silver back out of it by throwing some copper in there and letting it uh, precip out. I don't know, but I'll fix it somehow. But uh, guaranteed tip. Oh, man. Stay away from these kind of jars. They're, they're never any good. They always rust up on you and fall into the crap. I don't know why anyone would use this for food. I always remember science is great.